Hey guys, Sarah here. Welcome back to my channel. As we transition to the new normal or better normal, we are all doing measures to fight COVID-19 and other diseases to stay healthy. We have prepared so many things to keep us safe like alcohol, face masks, face shields, air purifiers, and one of the tools is a germicidal ultraviolet or UVC light. Now the question is, does it work? What does it do, really? So if you guys are interested, stick around because I'm here to pass it on. Now we have three UVC lights, but before I share information about them, let's talk about what UVC is. What is germicidal UV or UVC light? Germicidal UV or UVC is part of the ultraviolet spectrum best known for its ability to inactivate pathogens like bacteria and viruses. Germicidal UV is used to disinfect rooms and surfaces. As of today, we know that COVID-19 can live on certain surfaces for up to three days, so it's critical to disinfect regularly. And UVC or UV light is very effective at eliminating 99.9% .9 of viruses and bacteria. UV wavelengths can range anywhere from 10 nanometers to 400 nanometers, but the effective UVC that is used for disinfection have wavelengths between 200 to 280 nanometers. So make sure that your UV light is emitting these wavelengths. Check the specifications of your UVC light before buying or using. Make sure it is specified that it is UVC not UVA or UVB, and that the wavelength is within 200 to 280 nanometers. Can UVC kill germs? According to research, UVC can change the DNA and RNA of bacteria and viruses, destroying their ability to reproduce. It inactivates viruses and kills bacteria. I'll be placing my sources link at the description box and you may also do your own research if you want to learn more about this. We have three UVC light devices in use. One for the entire room disinfection and two are portable which are for travel disinfection use. Our room UV light is 20 watts with ozone disinfection. We use it one to two times a week per room and as needed. It has a very nice automatic off feature after 15 minutes of use, which is useful when you leave it in a room during disinfection. It also has a remote control. Our portable UVC lights are both small and handy, but one is more convenient since it can close and protect the bulb during travel. The other one is slightly more powerful, but is also slightly bigger in size. Both devices are less than 10 watts in power. One has auto off after two minutes and the other without auto off. So we use different UVC light devices for different purposes. Take note that UVC light can be very effective and beneficial when used correctly. Each device has its own instruction, so just follow what is in the box. With so many UV light devices for sale today, it is very important to check for features that make your device useful. The specifics will depend on the purpose, but in general, we look for these features in a UVC light device. Number one, portability, meaning size. If for home use, we need something powerful enough to irradiate an entire room, so size will not matter much for this purpose. But for travel or everyday use, it is best if it can fit in a small bag and is protected against breakage. Next, auto off feature. For safety purposes, it's better to have an auto off feature to prevent accidents, especially when you're using it for longer duration, like disinfecting rooms or homes. Next is power supply. Is it USB charging or AC wall charge? For portable devices, it is best to have USB charging to make it easier to bring around since you can charge the device using your phone charger or power bank. Just remember that you cannot use the device while it's charging. But for home use, then an AC wall charge is more important 
since the device will be used for more than 5 minutes at a time. Our room device takes 15 minutes per disinfection but can also be set to turn off after 30 or 60 minutes. Just a reminder, UVC lights are effective, but they have side effects when not used properly. So make sure to check the instructions first before you use them. Please do be careful when using these devices since significant UVC light exposure can cause skin irritation or burns and eye irritation. Ozone gas that is emitted during disinfection can also cause respiratory irritation and may cause cough or difficulty breathing. Remember that it can damage any living thing during use, which includes plants, animals, and of course, you. So guys, I hope this video helps. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever I have new videos. And guys, you can also share this video to your family and friends if you find this helpful. Remember, disinfect to protect. Alright guys, see you on the next one. Bye! Stay healthy and God bless!